Hello. Hi. Welcome to the stream. The video game stream. I am extremely tired. And I am extremely tired. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm tired and sick and sick and tired. I've made that joke every single stream for the last two weeks. So get used to it because it's not going to go away anytime soon, I guess. I got coffee. I got um I got video games. So I wanna play a video game. How about? Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna play Heartbound. Am I sick and tired of making jokes about being sick and tired? I'm starting to get there, I'll tell you what. I tell you what. I, that's a Jeff Foxworthy joke for all you people with good taste out there. <laughs> Except. I'm going to start a new game. Do you really want to forget? Yes, for a start for a heavy heart. So yeah, the joke of the title of this stream is that I, like a lot of people, found out about this game through a, uh, a game theory stream. Oh, you might want to hear the music. That's important. Uh, through a game theory stream that uh, they they played this game and they were like, oh, is it is it a heart? Is it an Undertale sequel? And a lot of people took them seriously. And nowhere in the stream or in the uh, description did they... Oh, that's the credits. Oh. Uh-huh. Oh, that's cute. Uh, nowhere in the stream or the credits in the, or the description of the stream did they... Uh, uh, list that this is actually a game that has absolutely no relation to uh, Undertale. And a lot of people who are fans of MatPat started harassing the creators of this video game. Like, they started harassing uh, Thor... What's his name? I can't remember his name, but it is. But one of, one of them is named Thor. And, like, they were like, hey... Are you Toby Fox? Why are you lying about being Toby Fox? What's wrong with you? You deserve to die. And then it took, like, it took Toby Fox to come in and be like, hey, this game is not related to anything that I do. And I talked to the Heartbound people and they're like, yeah, it's the thing is, like, it does have shades of Undertale for sure because they're both games that are inspired by Earthbound. Like they played, they're just people who played a lot of the same games. And it turns out that it was a game theory's uh, policy to not post the links to any of the games that they played in live streams unless they were free or fan made. What the fuck? <laughs> anyway. That got me to buy this game. Basically, like I went and decided to watch the trailer after I saw that uh, uh, Toby Fox had reacted to that. And I'm like, oh, I want to see because, you know, fuck Matt Pat, fuck Game Theory. I want to see what's going on with the, with the video game. And I watched the trailer and I fell in love with it instantly and I bought it. And then I did a video where I talked about it for a minute. And I basically just recapped that whole thing. Boof, boof. He's out like a light. I love that dog. There we go. All set to battle the day. Got a hoodie on. Turn on the light. Ow! Yikes! Lore, are you okay, buddy? I think so. The light switch is toast, though. I'm gonna head back to bed. This day is already sour enough.
Wait, what about breakfast? Dude, it's too early for food. It's never too early for food. Where's your sense of adventure? Sleeping like we should be. You know I can't open the can. Oh, fine. Let's get going then. Your fault if anything else goes wrong. Dad follows you. I love it. Damn, he must be up. Let's get some clowns in chat for Matt Patrick. <laughs> That's okay. Maybe he's in a good mood today. Hey, kiddo. Moron. The kitchen trash is overflowing. Go take it out. Problem solved. That wasn't so bad, right? Always the optimist. At least it's just the trash. This broken painting clearly depicts a slayer of champions. Looks like the power is still on. That's good, at least. <laughs> One of the rudest things we remember Game Theory doing was telling actual Hindu Hindus that Smite's depiction of their goddess Kali is actually not sexist at all. Wow, I never heard about that. That's amazing. Cool. Things are looking up for our brave adventurer. <laughs> yes, you're right. Let's press on, you silly mutt. Mutt? How rude. How rude. Yep, that was a Star Wars prequel reference. You're welcome, everybody. An exquisite shelf stands before you. Oh, this is... You found a smelly sock. Gross. Put it in your inventory. Definitely the best seat in the house. Let's see what we got on television. How's the volume, by the way? Keep piling up. Wish she would quit already. I love the light effects from the window. The can is over on the counter. I'd open it myself, but pies and stuff. Obtained a can of Viking Feast brand dog food. Nice! That's my favorite one! It's full of socks? You can't even wash them. There isn't any soap. Everything in here has gone bad. About the right size for a head! Collect the trash? No. Turn on the stove? Yes! Great, now it's a fire hazard. It's also the one speculating on whether fictional videos game women's breast had it. implants? What? I missed that too. Feed bear in the Viking feast? Yes. The glorious Viking feast pours from the can into Baron's bowl. It has little shaped a little axe-shaped meats in it. I always wanted to be a Viking. They're so cool. Yeah, I'm sure. Hurry up so we can get going. I'm already done. What? How did you finish so fast? With Viking power. Let's go finish our adventure. I love, I love dog. Collect trash. Game theory is an infinitely deep pit of stinky garbage takes. Absolutely. Throw out the garbage? Yes. Garbage fills the trash can to the top. The Vikings have slain the garbage monster. You make a you make a great Viking yak now. Thanks. You make a decent one yourself. Just decent? Alright, you make a great Viking. You know, yak now. <laughs> I'll take the axe. Getting ready for a Viking LARP? I won't judge you. Throw out Matt Pat. Absolutely. Look at this cute little house in the middle of the damn desert. Desert? Forest? In the middle of nowhere. You found a wet sock. Slimy. Put it in my pocket. Gotta keep the socks. Hey, Lore? Yeah, what's up? Just wanted to say I had a really good time today. Yeah, me too. Let's head back to bed, all right? Sounds good, buddy. A 
A desert of civilization. Yes. Gotta turn everything off. Don't want to be rude. You may have an you, you may have an axe, but this isn't that kind of game. Last one there's a rotten egg. Too much water and not enough sun, just like the rest of this place. Oof. Already asleep. Boof boof. Look at that sprite. That sprite is so good. Already fast asleep. Right to sleep? Yes. Uh... Hey, buddy. I know things can get tough sometimes. Just don't forget to have fun, even if it all looks grim. Follow your heart, and don't give up on anything or anyone. I will always be with you right by your side. We got this. Bad times! Bad times happen. Door gone. There's a huge slash across the back. No more adventures for this warrior. The door is jammed. It's not even strawberry. What could have made these? Must have died during the night. Power's out. More stuffing than last Thanksgiving. Half of the best seat in the house. This thing is terrible reception. Well, at least it isn't a fire hazard now. Baron's collar! Must be close by. Don't worry, buddy. I'm on my way. There's a ledger set on this stump. Each page is smudged with damp ink. Record the journey so far? Yes. Sinks into the page and fades out. Your progress has been saved. The storm is getting worse. Going back to bed seems like a good idea. Rest for a while? No. Puzzle time! You will understand when it's over. This is for the best. Nightmare, this isn't real. Leave me alone! You aren't real! Baron is fine. It's just a dream. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Okay. Oh shit. I wasn't damn it. Give him back. That is quite enough.
all this ancient speak. I don't know how to say these these words. Don't give up. You can beat this. Time to wake up. Home at last. Where am I? What is this? Where's Baron? You're safe and in my library. Enlighten me on what a Baron is. My dog. He's more than that. Baron's my best friend. I see. I'm sorry to say things are a bit more complicated than you would like. What do you mean? Where is he? In a place beyond this world. I can help, but it will not be easy for either of you. Just tell me where he is. Please calm yourself. I am not your enemy. I'm sorry. None of this makes any sense. I didn't mean to snap at you. That's quite all right, Lore. Life doesn't always make sense. We make do with what we have. What? How do you know my name? I'll tell you when you're older. As for me, you may call me Binder. What? Your name is Binder? Feel free to look around. I will be setting the time. Oh, Dargo. Opening the chest reveals an apple. Hey, that's private. These books are glued together. You can't even pick them up. There's a terrarium with a large stick placed in the center. I see you found Agnes. Her bark is worse than her bite, I can assure you. Little brown book, big red book. A baby book tower. It's cute. Some kind of cookbook? Papers in a strange runic text litter the table. It's a ledger. Yes. This place feels cozy and warm. Binder will understand if you take a nap. Rest for a while? No. Actually, yes. So what's fun is each time you start the game or pause or whatever uh, after you save, uh, you wake up in your room and you leave and it returns you to where you were. But all the items that you've collected start accruing around here. So like that's Baron's collar. That's the can of food. That's the food bowl. This is the pile of socks and there's socks everywhere. So the, so the socks start piling up and like stuff gets on the shelf here. You get the axe up there. It's really, it's really a nice thing. Nice touch. Oh, snow glasses followed. Thank you. Darksiders are born from anomalies in the early stages of corruption. These creatures are twisted manifestations of the original inhabitants of the page. Hi. The host's mind. Oh. And eons has followed. Thank you. The host's mind and features are altered drastically as the corruption takes hold. Hello. Don't know why you followed me yet. You follow me everywhere. I'm going to read these from left to right, actually. At the spine of the world, a guardian perceives every page simultaneously. Guardians can move freely between these pages to record any and all events. The flood of information brought on by the power of the spine can be overwhelming. Let's see. A guardian may only change events on a given page if the presence of an anomaly is detected. Without such an anomaly, the guardian passes through a page unnoticed and invisible to inhabitants. Decademic is followed. Thank you. Living as ghosts, the guardians wait and watch over the pages of creation. Anomalies can manifest in many different forms at any given place or time within a, within a page. As the anomaly progresses, aspects of the page may become corrupted. The results of this corruption are highly unstable and impact each host differently. Darksiders are born from anomalies in the early stages of corruption. These creatures are twisted manifestations of the original inhabitants of the page. The host's mind and features are altered drastically as the corruption takes hold. Okay. Oh, Kitar has followed. Thank you. 
sudden influx of followers. Mama Book Tower guards her young. Pat Pat Book Tower stands strong. I love the Book Tower. A strange research paper. How to prepare a dwarf in a jar. Is that a Full Metal Alchemist reference? Brother Book Tower hides behind his mama. The leather-bound tome shifts away when you reach for it. Don't worry, it's just shy around new people. Uncle Book Tower is being shady. Very faint mist swirls in one of the jars. It's thriving despite the humble arrangement. Auntie Book Tower is spying on Uncle Book Tower. The twin terrariums each have a stick placed in the center. Research paper is focusing on the breeding habits of sticks. What? The bright red book tries to gobble up your hand. Careful with that. There are only a few known to exist. You found a sock reading a book. Smart. Grandfather Book Tower guards his family from the north. I see you've met the Book Towers. Can you believe they all came from the same family tree? This entire bookcase was carved out of a single block of wood. You can't even read the books. A shiny crisp apple sits on the shelf. It seems stuck in place by some unknown force. It was an advanced pun. Oh, uh, looking for a link as to where to get this game. You know what? I can set that up. Um. Yeah. Um. Like I have it on Steam. Oh, what merch do they have? <gasps> uh oh, uh oh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold up. Hold on a sec. Wait a minute, just a second. Hold on. Uh, huh? I'm just, I'm gonna, uh, no, not you. Uh, you. I'm gonna just scooch you up a, a scotch and just be sort of. They have a barren plush. A plush of the dog. Ah! Okay. Alright. Uh, get out of here. Get out of here. Alright. Very good. They also got shirts and tees. And Stickers? Oh, those stickers are really cute, too! I want all of them! Ah, uh, I want every single one of these things! God. Why am I... I like stuff! I like shiny things too much. Okay. Uh, let's see. How can I... Dogs are very good. I'm not used to, uh, that's fine. Whatever. Just look up Heartbound. Just look up Heartbound in places. An old dark carrot lays uh, in a terrarium on the shelf. The label says, break glass in case of goblin. Weird, why would a goblin need a carrot? Pouring myself some more coffee. Uh. I think, yeah. It's important to stop and enjoy the little things. I'm glad you understand that. The clock is ready for you. Unfortunately, you must handle this trial alone. Trial? Clock? What are you talking about? In order to save Baron, you will need to go somewhere I cannot. There is an artifact of great power trapped between worlds. This clock will take you to it. Can it really bring Baron back? I hope so. It's the best chance we have. I understand. Stand back. I will open the way through. Gotta switch panels on. Yeah, there we go. 
The connection is established. Please step inside. That's almost a Morty voice. Hey, Binder? Yes, Lore? Thanks. Think nothing of it. You would do the same for me. My theory is that they are the same person and that Binder is, is uh, Lore from the future. Uh, but that's a too obvious theory, which is why it's false. Hope this works. This place is falling apart. I hope Binder is right. Binder is Ness, actually. This is true. Bong. Great job getting through that. Let me know if you need help. Yeah, let me ask help for, uh, let me just ask for help from a disembodied voice. Quality plan. I heard that. Oh, oh no. Let me pick up this sock. A levitating sock. Space. God, this is the final challenge. The next room holds the artifact. All right, I'll try not to get lasered in space and stuff. Quality plan. This game is so good. I love the music in this game. This game is a game, it's true. Now, the real question is, how does this game tie into Five Nights at Freddy's? You're almost there. Lore is Golden Freddy, <laughs> duh. <laughs> You're almost there. The artifact is just up ahead. Be careful, Lore. I'm gonna have to come up with some serious character voices soon. Wait, something's wrong. Binder, what's going on? I understand now. Lore, get out of there! Something's going on! I'm scared, make it stop! We need this to save him. <laughs> This is actually, oh, I was like you once. Oh, I need to. Full of hope, ambition, curiosity, fear. Now I am here, trapped in this, here in this prison place waiting for you. Show me why he chose you. Show me why you matter. Wake up, Lore. Wake up and smell the ashes. <laughs> Improve yourself. Wake up, Mr. Freeman. It's time to smell the ashes. A uh, Baron! You can't run this time. So I haven't played this game since, you can do this just a little further, since uh, January? And like the game is still in early access. He's not coming back. Uh, you weren't there for him, now he's gone. But 
they've they've changed some things and it feels good knowing what you did what kind of person you are uh oh, everything is going to be okay just keep moving uh so yeah the game is still in early access uh so they've been like updating it periodically and they like they like they they live stream the entire development process and uh so they've added a world since i last played it you failed him it's your fault you're already out for blood what are you waiting for go then see where hope takes you Can you feel it? He's waiting for you. That's not a good sign. I don't like it. Not a fan. You can't fight him. The ledger set on nightmares. Let's call it nightmares. Record the journey. Wait, no, yes. It's cold and clean. See your chin. This place can't be real. Maybe if you wake up, it will go away. No. Yeah, I haven't kept up super well with the development process. Like I said, it's been a while since I played the game. Um. So this will be my first time seeing some new stuff, I'm sure. Okay. I believe I remember reading about them having simplified this area a little bit. You're not ready. The story ends here. Enough! All you do is lie. I don't care about you or any of this. I just want to find Baron and go home. So let me get on with it. Good luck, kid. You're gonna need it. The nightmare is made out of Bach cheese. Not you again. I don't care what you are. Get out of my way. True fight. Ah, shit. one that always screws me up. I don't know what you're saying. Stop talking and fight. Uh... I said stop talking! Uh...
Oh shit. Fuck, fuck. Don't give up fighting! Wait, what? This is it. Don't hold back. I don't understand. This isn't right. Sometimes the only way forward is through. You got this. You were right. Your story isn't over. But his is. No! Baron! This can't be happening. Don't leave me alone. Not after all this. How touching. Am I interrupting you? No, no, no. Please leave us alone. We just want to go home. He earned this. You both did. I... I won't let you do this. I won't let you hurt him. I won't let you hurt anyone. Ang angry... prologue speech. I don't... Protean... You can't stop me. Not yet. Dog is stone. Ah, they won't even let you go yet. Okay. So yeah, basically... Uh... Our pro tag is Goku. Yeah, a little bit. So yeah, basically the point of this game is you're trying to find the pieces of your dog to bring him back. So you did it. You actually finished him. Hope it felt good. Enjoy your reward. Just leave me alone. Or what? Or... Nothing, I guess. That's it. Just let it go. What is this? What are you doing? No, stop! You can't do this! Hey, there it is. Slurp. I got a heart in me. Where, where am I? Baron, are you here? water cooler stands idly by waiting to hear untold stories of office life the handle rattles but the door remains unmoved small multicolored papers litter the board the words seem to shift as you try to read them
The device burst to life with a happy jingle. Text rapidly displays on the screen. Four of us there are, but none of us the same. Our favorite numbers block your path and muddle in your brain. If you find you can't compete and would rather rest today, you can always feed us seven ones and be right on your way. Something clicks and the machine powers down. It's full of tax papers? Gross. Some loose folders with scraps of paper strewn about. Single sticky note is glued to the shelf. Our first wolf's down food so fast he says he's eight instead of eating. There's a jar of red pickles in here. Pickles are gross. I love pickles. The jar of pickles evaporates. Weird. It's covered in silly doodles of lizard people. Say hello to the floor, lizard paper. Small keypad stuck to the desk. A single giant eraser sits in the drawer. The word pencil is printed neatly on the side. Weird. Notation on the financial implications of middle management. Our third is younger than the others. He's barely come of age. This is an odd Kingdom Hearts world. You're right. The drawer is stuck and won't open. Books detailing the history of employees of the month. It's all the same guy until pretty recently. Our second is the mightiest, they say. He really gives a beating. White letters on red paper. What kind of monster made this? Nephew Book Tower is a verified number smith. Our first wolf stones food so fast he says eight and some eating. Sit. Sit. Four of us. None the same. Okay. So the first number is eight. First it says blah blah blah. Get the sock. Oh, a sock note is pinned to the board. Informative. I never noticed the sock. Our fourth and final is a forty, where love has set the stage. So the first number is eight. Yeah. They say he really gives is the mightiest. Or second is the mightiest. They say he really gives a beating. What does that mean? Mightiest? Would that just be a nine? He's younger than the other. He's barely come of age. And then is a 40 where love is at the, at the stage. So is it... Is it 8, 9, 16, 16. There's no... Huh. Huh. There's no zero. Yeah, the thing about this puzzle is that it's supposed to be really hard, and that's why you can feed the computer system seven ones to skip past it. Yeah, I've just, like, I've never been able to solve it, and I just kind of want to. Um... Hmm. 
I honestly don't know. I'm terrible at riddles. And I know this is just like a basic wordplay problem. But, oh well, let's just move on. Uh oh. More? Dad? You can't be here. Dad, Baron's hurt. I. I can't let them do this. I can't let her find you. What are you doing? Stop, I need. I need you to leave now. Wait! I said go! Dave Strider? Yeah, I just got. Dad's got Dave Strider energy for sure. And we're back here. No, this can't be real. I can't be back here. Ah, you. Every time anything goes wrong, it's always you. Just leave us alone. Save them from themselves. Bend it to your will. Seal the darkness. Seal the light, bend it to your will, save them from themselves. Dave signless, yeah, seriously. So this is an interesting thing where you basically have four choices. Uh, where you've got the nominally good energy, the uh, nominally bad energy, you can go for both, you can go for one or the other, or you can go for neither. And I am uncertain as to how this impacts things. I'm gonna go with just purple energy. The choice is made. In light of what you're doing, I've been more than merciful. What a good friend. Wait, where am I? I love the music in this zone. Ah, and here's this boy. What's this guy's voice? He's got kind of like a skeevy gangster voice. Boo! Why? Nice. Hazing the intern's gonna be easier than I thought. What are you talking about? I'm not an intern. You're a new employee of Tower Corp. Welcome to the club, bucko. Mm, that's not fun. Welcome to the club, bucko. Hmm. What? What kind of... You're a new employee of Tower Corp. Welcome to the club, bucko. Hmm. That seems kind of fun. I don't work here. Leave me alone. Look, kid, I know you don't belong here. Mm. Give him a JP Lobster daddy voice. Oh, God, I can't do that. Obviously. Keep it down. Just play the part for now. You got it? Oh, God, that hurts my voice. I can't do that one. That one requires I get, like, deep in the back of my throat. <clears> throat> Eh, keep it down. Just play the part for now, get it? Alright, I guess I can do that. That's my intern! Now meet me in the boardroom at once! Third row on the right. Can't miss it. 
Got it. Also, don't bump into anything. This is a John Mulaney voice. Oh my god, you're right. <laughs> the birds are still out on the floor and they don't take kindly to new faces. And I said no, like a liar. <laughs> Catch you soon. Never thought I'd be a paper pusher. Growing up fast is weird. So the music in this zone is absolutely incredible. Because, like you can hear there, you've got percussion that is uh, the keyboard. I'm going to just up the volume here so you can hear it better. Uh, Shadow Mulaney, the intern reminds me. Sarah, your performance on the newest bad advertising was phenomenal. Oh, thank you! See, so yeah, you got the percussion that's keyboard, and then you've got the fax machine slash telephone that's like your melody, and then there's just lots of office noises used to make this, the music. It's just so good. <laughs> Thank you about, uh, yeah, I had a lot of fun on advertising. Haley messaged me like an hour before recording and was like, hey, do you want to be on advertising? Because <laughs> I had told her about my idea uh, to, uh, uh, to to do a uh, intern who was just a normal person. And she was like, oh my God, that's a great idea. And then I pitched that to Penny uh, in the call and she was like, holy shit, we've never had just a, a normal person. This is excellent. So we had a lot of fun with that. We don't, we don't deserve dogs. We do deserve cats though. I agree with that. Uh oh, uh oh. Keep asking questions. One day you'll be the one with all the answers. Always help those around you to have a better day. Even if you look a little silly doing it. There's a face in here. It's yours. A mirror sits in the bottom of the drawer. There's a newspaper in here that you can't understand the language. A picture of the moon covers the front page. Sorry, Katar. I'm not. I won't spoil anything else. My I, That's like the first thing that you learn about my characters. That they're just like an ad exec. An old handheld gaming console is in here. It's out of batteries. Blinking lights in a field of darkness. I think that's a Neuromancer reference, but I can't tell. There are like 50 pens in here. Don't get caught by the flying cameras. Don't hate it till you ate it. There are a bunch of gummy words in here. You try to write something with them, but your hands get all sticky. I never could come up with anything wholesome to say. It's full of Tower Court propaganda. Join the cause? Yes. Sweet. Time to forward the corporate agenda. <laughs> Working in an office can be stressful. Make sure to take breaks when you can. It's filled with gold doubloons. Wait, these are just chocolate coins. Same. Making stuff is hard. Anyone telling you otherwise is selling you something. A hamster sleeps soundlessly in here. His name tag reads Houdini. Well, I love them. We all work down here. It's not so bad, though. There's a page with heartbound spoilers scrawled at the top. Fortunately, someone spilled coffee on it. Make sure to keep up on your side projects. Passion keeps us going. It's empty. But wait, what's this? Oh, look. It's nothing. <laughs> nothing but gay. You found a hard-working sock. Business. This computer is ridiculous. You can't even see the screen. Don't forget to talk to people on the outside. Make time for them. There's a small ant farm here. They look rather industrious. Try not to eat so much fast food. 
It may be quicker, but it will make you thicker. There's a mug in the drawer with messy writing on the side. World's best dad. My hat is super cool. Best anime hero in Tower Corp. It's full of individual hot sauce packets. Some of these are ancient. It's just a bunch of garbage data. A bunch of papers with poorly drawn ducks on them. I wish I could be a poorly drawn duck. Disagreements happen sometimes. You don't always have to win. Looks like some kind of schematic for a pen flinging catapult. Office feuds are leveling up. It's easy to feel like you don't measure up. Just remember, everyone else feels the same. There's a label maker in here. Oops. Thank. Thank. Okay, I had to check to make sure that that was correct. Thank. <laughs> Don't regret your actions. They were your allies at the time. It's filled with assorted colored candies. The colors consist of red and off red. Thank. Post no bills, post no paychecks either. Dude, can you stop doing that? Nah, being lazy is half the fun. Well, what did you need me for anyway? I like you, kid. You got pizzazz. So, so I'm gonna help you out. What's the catch? Just a favor, something harmless. Sound good? Not like I have a choice. That's the spirit. Check the whiteboard for a password. You'll need it for work. Oh yeah, one more thing. Don't do anything my buddy Whistler here wouldn't like. He can get pretty direct, if you know what I mean. What's his voice? Pleasure to meet you. I look forward to working with you. See you around, intern. <laughs> See ya. Instructions on how to contact HR. They're all scribbled out. There's a familiar book sitting on a very bright desk. Record your journey so far? Yes. The progress has been saved. A thrum of ringing phones fills the air. You slowly nod your head to the sound, fighting back sleep. Sleep on the job? Yes. Thank. So, like, yeah. Now you've got, like... You've got a poster there. The, pile, the box of socks has gotten bigger. Or the pile of socks. The book is there. Now I guess I'm carrying the axe. I joined the cause. Whoa. New, new, new hire password. Love. Cubicle assignment 6A. Hi, I'm Oscar. Beep boop. Submit password. God, password, QWERTY, love. God. Hey, that's not the right password. Get out of here. Love. Access granted. New hire. Sorting will now begin. Sorting? Performance category, smartliness. New hires failed initial testing procedures. Smartliness is clearly lacking. Yeah, well, that's just your opinion, man. Performance category, speederosity. New hire is extremely slow under pressure. New hire may be a tortoise. You're a computer, you can't even move. Performance category, sneakitude. New hire is like a ghost, unable to determine if new hire is present even now. A cookie is dispensed from the CD drive. Well, thanks. Congratulations, new hire. Based on your performance, you are assigned the role of supervisor. I'll keep my opinion to myself, thank you. Thankfully, we already have too much over it, so I'm sending you to the ma mail shroom instead. Wait, I don't want a job. First row on the right. Don't be late. Addendum. Based on performance, new hire is a threat to... 
Nobody! Promote to management during next cycle. Thank you! This unit's function is now concluded. Yeah. It's just a jumble of papers stuck to nothing? The mail shroom. Is this a Dilbert comic? It's more progressive than a Dilbert comic. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean... You're the new hire, I presume? Yeah, I guess. Good, I've been expecting you. Expecting me? Step over here, don't be shy. There we go, much better. So, what do I have to do? Stamp each letter as it arrives. That's it? That's it. Alright, I can do that. Good. I'll be attending to other matters. Do your best. Let's go through this door now into the stairs. This game has opinions about working in an office and the sorts of things it does to the human soul. Maybe this isn't so bad. This place... These people... Comforting repetition. No surprises. Nothing hidden. He always loved it so much too much I very much feel this the sense that like oh maybe this isn't so bad you know, it's not a fulfilling job, but it's something. It occupies the time. And surrounded as you are by all of these like ghosts that are just sharing platitudes about the pointless work that they're doing. Uh, I think it says a lot about. I guess we aren't very different. It says a lot about like how corporate culture takes positivity and kind of turns it into a tool of, of controlling people. Like, no, you gotta be positive. You gotta have a good attitude. Don't forget to have hobbies outside of work. Just as long as they're not, you know, making you any money. Do pointless things with your time. Oh, I didn't know Marble donated money yesterday. How did I miss that? Or did I miss that? I don't recall. No, I shouldn't be doing this. I need to go find him. Well, I mean, you should, but that doesn't mean you will. You again. Me again! 
in. Time for a new job. Wait, really? Well, yeah. I mean, you just kind of walked away from this one. What if I was taking a break? No breaks in Tower Corp! How do you feel about computers? I guess they're okay. Great! Time for some IT work! First row on the left! Don't be late! See a new nerd hire! Wait, did, what did you just... The screen is dark and unresponsive. This cabinet is a little cramped. There's not much room in here. Haha! <laughs> I love this. Filled with letters from the employees, the cart is bolted to the floor. The ink cartridge is empty. Time to throw out the printer and buy a new one. The door rattles but won't budge. The music in this room is, uh, it's good. Well, I went over to the stairs, but nothing happened. Cheshire Creeper. I just can't. Same. Oh, this, this game is very much about this kid's strained uh, relationship with his family. Well, there's a way to go into F-Zero of Heartbound? Interesting. I don't know how to do it. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, Yug. All right. What do? It does what it do, Yug. I don't think I looked at these books. The emails do end eventually. Don't let them overwhelm you. The drawer is jammed full of Tower Corp brand cup noodles. That's a lot of nudes. Lol. Working in an office can be stressful. Make sure to take breaks when you can. Yeah, yeah. I think making stuff is hard. Anyone telling me? Otherwise, selling something. Yeah, yeah. Don't wait for the perfect moment to follow your dreams. Do it, or you never will. It's full of a ton of spoons stolen from the cafeteria. Uh oh. The night shift can be tough sometimes. Keep going, even if that means going alone. Go over to the janitor's closet, drink the water, then go back to the stairs. Okay, sign a copy of How to Speak French by an actual potato sits in the drawer. Uh, where is... Stare at this poster until the security board picks you up. The management. Nah. So this will be the IT department here. Uh-oh. Woo! Whoa! 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 Can't go there. full of something nasty. Toilet paper? This place doesn't even have a toilet. Drink the water? This seems fine. It tastes like it looks. Wait, this was a mistake. You had a nightmare that Sarah wasn't streaming right now. 
Thank God it wasn't real. Marble, you actually just missed the scene where I was thinking of you because it was about soul crushing office work. Have fun at Penny Stream, Snow Glass. Uh oh. Less than a week left. Congrats, Marble. The boy into the void. I see you survived the fall. Ah, this form disturbs you. Guardians change depending on the world they enter. I have no control over it. Wait, Binder? Correct! With that settled, have you found the artifact? Yes, this is the game that MatPat called Undertale 2. Lie to him. Oh yeah, happy birthday, Artemis. He doesn't need to know. I've never seen it. A shame. A shame. We will have to look elsewhere. So how do we get Baron back? Make your way through the tower. Find a fragment of his essence. What do you mean a fragment? What does it look like? A point of light that shifts gently while observed. This doesn't make any sense. How is that even possible? I will explain when it's over. When it's over? What does that even mean? It must be hard in your situation. I hope you will see the truth in the end. Why not just tell me now? My explanation will have to wait for another time. No, I need to know what's going on. Goodbye for now! Everyone's streaming. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. It won't turn on. <laughs> oh Watch your step. Stair related injuries are not covered on your medical plan. The management. Oh, this music has got a foreboding air to it. Gotta check my phone really quick. Spooky heart breathing. Oh, that's just a heart. Tower Court Brand Neural Network 6. 7. 3. Oh, God. 2. 5. 4. 5. Okay. Seven, nine, four, four, okay. This is spooky. Wait, what? D. Five, one, seven, seven. 6A, 59, 9, found an engineer's sock, trustworthy, 7, ah, a shroom friend, 
Hello, Lore. What seems to be on your mind? How do you know my name? I'm the head of the Inhumane Resources Department. It's my job to know. Don't you mean human resources? I meant what I said. Do you have any complaints to register? No, I think I'm good. Mm. Oh. Designation, the faceless. Role, menial worker. Term, lifetime. Description, expendable workers created to perform low-level jobs. Free will removed and replaced with happy, wholesome thoughts to promote productivity. Subject must be kept isolated for the duration of their term. Role can be improved only when subject displays elevated levels of ambition. Manufacturing requirements, one positive memory. Woof. Designation, Pool Pal Paul. Role, garbage collection, term lifetime. Description, a low intelligence worker created to remove unwanted material from the tower. Multiple subjects may be kept in close proximity under high levels of compression. Subject generates positive memories when fed digestible materials. Manufacturing requirements, three faceless, one cup of coffee. Designation, Gator. Role, defensive security, term lifetime. Egyptian, a cynical worker created to defend the tower from external influences, has experienced increasing entropy due to proximity with designation fish. Future iterations will be put in isolation to improve productivity. Manufacturing requirements, one faceless, one salty lemon. Designation, short stack, real gym management, term lifetime. Description, a high ambition worker created to oversee and manage physical exercise routines. Current iteration does not grant beneficial information to the tower. Repurpose materials during next cycle. Manufacturing requirements, one ambitious faceless, one egg. Designation, that guy, roll that guy, term lifetime. In every corporate environment, there is always that guy. Previous iterations of the tower resulted in collapse due to his absence. That guy is necessary for session stability despite universal hatred for it. Manufacturing requirements, one nosy faceless, one fish in a microwave. The, cor the Corprino brothers, the Coprino brothers, cafeteria workers term lifetime. A trio of workers designed to quickly manage mundane sorting tasks currently assigned to cafeteria operations to ensure all faceless are fed accordingly. Due to constant infighting, this configuration is deemed ineffective. Repurpose materials during next cycle. Three faceless, one egg salad sandwich. Designation unknown. Role janitor. Term unknown. An intruder existing within a pocket dimension of the tower. Monitor and extract information. Role assigned to janitor to produce entropy and other workers. Manufacturing requirements unknown. Oof, Artemis. I'm, a, I'm immune to being turned into a basic slave. I have no positive memories. Yikes. Fair enough. Designation Whistler. Cafe Barista. Lifetime. An obedient and powerful worker created for physical security and menial labor. This iteration possesses singularly impressive intelligence and understanding of the tower. Monitor actions at all times. Dissect and analyze during next cycle. Manufacturing requirements, one faceless, one equine skull. Designation Trapper, passive manager, term lifetime. A middle manager designed to inspire other workers through understanding and empathy. Current iteration spends its time with designation chopper in an endless feedback loop. Split subjects during next cycle. Repurpose materials if issue persists. Manufacturing requirements, one faceless, one pitcher plant. Yes, Marble, I think this game may in fact be anti-capitalist. I like how I was sitting at like 30 viewers and then Penny started streaming and I've lost like half of my audience. Uh, designation fish role offensive security term lifetime a worker created to attack systems and exploit assets the subject was originally designed to harden the tower from outside influences this iteration has unfortunately failed and the subject is obsessed with ducks repurpose materials during the next cycle one faceless one duck overlap is a hack you're right 
My Cell, Inhumane Resources, Term Lifetime, Description, a vicious worker created to protect the company at all costs, coerces workers into revealing their misgivings with tower operations, collected data helps identify future defectors, repurpose defectors for materials immediately, manufacturing requirements, one faceless, one sinister memory. Assignation Inky, Mail Sorter, Lifetime. <gasps> Excuse me. A nervous and obedient worker created to sort mail within the tower. Mail materials are repurposed upon completion of sorting. Faceless are allowed to send one letter per cycle to improve morale. Subject is exhibiting potential to defect. Monitor and repurpose as necessary. One faceless, one letter home. Designation Joe Regular. Executive assistant, term unknown. Description, an extremely dangerous entity. Replicates at will, but cannot interact with the environment directly. Uses manipulation to forward unknown goals. Purge attempts unsuccessful. Role assigned to executive assistant to reduce entropy in other workers. Manufacturing requirements, one errant bit. Interesting. Designation chomper. Aggressive manager, term lifetime. A middle manager designed to inspire other workers through pointed and direct feedback. Current iteration spends its time with designation trapper in an endless feedback loop. Split subjects during next cycle. Repurpose materials if issue persists. Manufacturing requirement one faceless, one toad. Designation the boss. A useless worker, meaning minimal. Interesting. Oh shit. A waste of resources cannot be repurposed materials. Repurposed during next cycle. Manufacturing one faceless, one actual garbage memory fan interesting can i read all that again or will it nope okay interesting dad's stuff is being rewritten one actual garbage Humpst. oscar tower operations term lifetime an adaptive artificial intelligence tasked with creating the perfect corporate environment manufacturing requirements one programmer's hope one child's memory Interesting. Documents describing an extensive neural network. There is a heart drawn across the page. Hastily scrolled plans to escape the tower by taking a leap of faith. There are hundreds of data sheets in here. All of them detail results from different tests called cycles. It's full of old photos. All of them are marked repurpose in large red letters. Wait, you're not supposed to be here. This was supposed to be my moment. This was supposed to be the cycle I finally escaped. All you had to do was stamp. All you had to do was stay. Oh no! I need to get out of here. The shelf is covered in supplies. It won't even share. How selfish. Uh oh. This is a bad time. Hello again, Lauren. Nope, okay, no complaints. Gotcha, gotcha. I just indirectly killed a goose room. <laughs> Caustic Grace, listening to you play this as I'm actively working in an office is uncomfortably meta. <laughs> yeah. What, Moe Ninja Cat? Wait, what? What does the info change? Nothing? just more information on stuff does the info change on the worker info oh! oh 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 that's a good question <gasps> oh 
Designation, none. Mail sorter, term lifetime. Description, position repurposed. Mail sorting is now automated. Oof. Oh no! Good catch, Moe Ninja Cat. <clears throat> And pour me some more coffee. Heartbound has mushroom friends. It's true. Game of the century. You right. I just wait until you see this next bit. Oh, I hear that bass slap. Hey, new hire, isn't this music groovy? Come back when you're done and stuff. A rack of bleak blanks. A rack of blinkety blanks. A rack of blinky blanks. A rack of blank blocks. A rack of blankety blocks. A rack of blanky blocks. A rack of block blanks. A rack of blankety blinks. A rack of blanky blanks. A rack nid. A rack of ribs. Little busy right now. Go see if fish needs anything. New guy, huh? Yeah, I've used that voice already. New guy, huh? Yeah, I guess so. Can't work right now. Need my ducks. What? My rubber ducks. I need them. Why do you need rubber ducks? Every programmer needs ducks. You should know this. New hires get greener every hiring cycle. That's just my sweater. First job for you. Find five ducks. Bring them here. I never thought work would be this... Weird. Gotta go find some ducks. Um, yeah, get out of here. Oh, duck, it sits on my head. Duck. Now two. Dose duck. Duck stack. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Duck. So many ducks. That's quack. You right. Duck. Already got four ducks. It helps that I've already played this game. Past the duck? Uh oh, uh oh. I'm gonna just keep going. Gotta let this guy. Fuck. Don't see me. Everything's fine.
Oh, I see it. Duck. Five ducks acquired. Where are you at? You got the ducks. Good. Go talk to Gator. Work is done here. Thanks for ducks. I don't think that's the voice that I gave him, but it doesn't matter. I took all morning to hide those ducks. Now he's never going to shut up about them. Hey, Gator, I got my ducks. If you need one, let me know. Ah, oh, he's already starting. Anyway, I take it you're the new hire then? You're doing fantastic work so far, kid. Oops. I keep click clicking out of the window. Thanks? In fact, I have an extra special job for you. Alright, what do you need? You know that machine covered in stickies out on the floor? Go get me one. Just any of them? Yes. Seriously, just a random sticky note. Yep, fine, I guess. Back in a minute. See ya. Gotta text my girlfriend. DNA Syncopatos. Does that mean five tiny ducks? I don't know Spanish. I'm bad. Nope. Oh, yes. Well, got one. Woo! Uh-oh. He puts it on his face. I forgot about that. Wow, you look ridiculous. You're clearly too skilled to waste your time here in IT. Talk to Oscar for reassignment. Uh, they have five decks. Thank you. It's fun to watch you play this game while procrastinating on translation jobs. Hell yeah. Hi, you look silly. Good joke. Wow, you look ridiculous. Thanks. Definitely too ridiculous for this boring job. Let's get you a new one. That's like way more fun. That really doesn't sound... Go play with your food. Second row on the left. Don't be late. Seriously? Also take that thing off your face. It's company property. Thanks for ducks. Ducks make me chuffed. Ducks make me chuffed, too. I dig a duck. I think they're rubber ducks, but they could be real ducks. Why well, can't be both? A duck is a duck, whether big or small. Uh-oh. Uh. <sighs> Cafeteria. A bunch of haphazard trays. They are currently devoid of sandwiches. Covered in spoons. Now to find some drama flakes. As rubber duck programming. Thinking to do sandwiches. 
Rubber duck programming? That has to listen to you explain your code the whole day. Yeah, does seem cruel. Hey, look, it's the new hire, fresh meat. <clears throat> Wait, what? Hurry, don't have all day. Lunch starting. Give them what they order. Orders are on the board. Check them. So we just hand them lunch? Give them food. Yes, check the board. Feed them. All right, got it. Good luck. Don't mess up or else. Okay. Oh, shit. What kind of monster gets two cans of soda for lunch? This music is very good. Four cans? So yeah, this game is about tedium. Or at least this part is. Never enough time for him. Fast as we can. No time. Oh, well, you did your best. Lunch rush lost. Shades depressed. Oh, no. Almost got him. Well, you finished, I guess. Not a great job. Weak performance. Talk to Oscar for reassignment. Go away. Keep losing what their voices are. Wow! Lunch rush is kind of terrifying. Yeah, that was pretty nuts. Sandwiches and drinks all over the floor. Did they even eat anything? Got kind of hectic in here. You missed a few employees. Thanks. The sandwich budget is destroyed, though. Bad job, new hire. Sandwich budget? Let's get you a new job. Clearly too many sandwiches in this one, right? How about a cubicle? Boxes are super productive. I'm a box. I would know. Looks like 4C is open right next to that weird shirt guy. Seriously? Have fun with the rest of your career! Just don't go over the fun budget. Also, wipe your shoes off. Those sandwiches are company property. Ah, uh, yes. No! <sighs> Into 4C. Hey, new hire, you made it! Yeah, here I am, I guess. Welcome to your new home! I really outdid myself on this one. Good job, Oscar! Home? How could anyone live here? I hear the carpet under the desk is extra comfy if you need a nap during your shift. How long is my shift? Hilarious question, new hire! Have fun, and don't leave your cubicle for any reason! 50 pence in the blinking lights in a field of darkness. 
Man, you're like really bad at following directions. In fact, you've been pretty bad at this whole time. The only people this bad at following directions are managers. By the compiler, you're a manager? Why didn't you tell me? We've got to get you upstairs immediately. The elevator is out to the north. I fixed the path for you. Well, Laura, you've done it. You beat the system by doing nothing. As we all must. Dude, this is taking forever. Well, yeah, you gotta give it a, you've gotta give it the Whistler special. Hello, Joe. You called. I need this door open. Can you help out a friend in need? Of course, Joe. Nice. Nothing like a good smashy smashy, right in turn? Need anything further? Nah, that's just fine. Thanks. See you soon, intern. Uh. Long time no see. All right, seriously. How do you teleport like that? With style, in turn! This place just kind of goes on forever, doesn't it? Been here my whole life and then some. Never seen an edge myself. Why are we going sideways anyway? Aren't elevators supposed to go up? Nobody moves up the corporate ladder. We all just side grade and pat each other on the back. That doesn't really sound worth it to me. There's a lot that's worth it when family is on the line. Anyway, this got kind of heavy. I'll see you on the other side, intern. That thing again. It's the heart and the book. The artifact. Where is it gone? No, it's not real. None of this is. Dad... I wish you would just listen to me. I don't know if I can do this alone. Time. Binder. Can I trust him? What have I done? It's for the best. No. I can't be like this anymore. I can't let it hurt me. I got this. There we go, that wasn't so bad, right? I guess. Gave me a minute to clear my head. Good, now it's time for the real work. So everything I just did wasn't real work? Nope! Anyway, time to pay up on that favor. Ugh, fine. Good, now let's get you a hat. This is ridiculous. You're ridiculous. <laughs> now that you look the part, I need you to do a little snooping around for me. What should I be looking for exactly? The boss. Wait, what? Look around, let me know what you find. All right, I can do that. I knew I could count on you, intern. An ambiguous job with unknown pay that could get me killed. Just what I always wanted. <sighs> yes. Yes. Couch looks incredibly comfy. Nobody will notice if we take a nap, right? Sleep on the job? Yes. Now I've got a hat, there's a sticky note, more socks, 
Pile of ducks. <sighs> it's a bunch of bank transfer statements. All of his money is going to an off-tower account. One day I'll leave this place. Not today, but one day. It's a shallow vera. They make rude comments when you're not looking. <laughs> Documents detailing some kind of holding company. It seems pretty complicated. Each of the sprouts has a name tag. All the name tags say, my son. Sealed up with vines. No way you're getting this open. Technology is destroying the natural world. We need to, to preserve the planet to survive. It's a mean old cactus. It's even got a beard. Mm -hmm. Full of pocket protectors. What a nerd. Copy that floppy? Yes. You didn't copy that floppy. You stole it instead. You stole that floppy. Technology is the only way forward. Without research, we will never save the planet. I like living on the edge. That's why I keep my drink on the edge of my desk. Thrilling. Blueprints for some kind of sideways elevator. That seems efficient. It's full of scrapped engineering ideas. They're not all stamped. They're all stamped with maroon. Applications for time off. All of them have been denied. Sounds about right. Crisp and clean new work. The pages even squeak when you move them. Every page is signed. Need us freakly. Weird. Pens on the left. Papers on the right. Stuck in the middle with you. The guy next to me is a total scumbum. It's Barf City. They all down my beloved smarmalade. The natural sock flavor is the best. Fools. This plant looks pretty smarmy. It's just oozing with smarm. It's full of jars labeled test batch. Gross. Hastily written recipe for smarmalade. The only thing I really have is my beautiful red stapler. A bunch of crude drawings of staplers. 47 issues of Stapler Monthly. Every page has a seductively posed stapler on it. It's full of replacement staple bricks. Take his only possession? Yes. You've doomed Tower Corp with your stapler greed. He's gone completely silent in the distance. Sirens. Ugh. All of these sandwiches seem oddly fresh. Looks like he's using this as a trash can. Gross. The guy next to me is a total neat freak. It's Barf City. This is way too many energy drinks. You don't have any money. Potential! You have the tools to make your boss look great. A calming autumn world. A soft wind blows through the trees. Gl glacial peaks stand defiant under a shifting sky. Jim Zone! You found a sweaty gym sock. Exercise! I got an achievement. This locker is locked. It's take its job seriously. There's an old red combination knock to it. Someone carved a C into the knob. It won't open. It's full of hundreds of pairs of round glasses. They don't even have lenses. There's a smooth metallic object in here. It's the, it's the back of the locker. It's smashed closed and can't be opened. It looks like it took hundreds of tiny punches. Working out with a buddy makes things pretty easy, especially when your buddy is as quick as Chomper. Gives me something to shoot for. Working out with a buddy makes things pretty easy, especially when your buddy is as slow as Trapper. Whoops. Uh-oh. Oh, no. I closed the game. Whoops. Uh-oh. My bad. Now I've got to fucking resize it.
Uh, this isn't a demo. This is, um, the game is still in early access, uh, but, but it's, it's not finished. But what's there is very strong. Um, it's still sort of in the process of being developed. All right. Let's not fuck that up again. Okay. What was there to take? Floppy? Yes. Stapler? Now that's a jam. And that's the last of my coffee. So I spill half of it on my desk. I'm gonna punch this bag. No money. Notice, all lost items will be held in the cafe until claimed or incinerated. A hauntingly beautiful forest in the dead of night. The moon is a chunk taken out of it. A sickly world of sand and cactus under a pale green sky. The wind howls against the glass. Ah, uh, here we go. Now we got a jam. The Tower Corp is out to get me, but I feel alright. Hey, stay away from my coffee. Hey, you're in my personal space. Hey, it's the new manager. What a green bean. That's kind of messed up. Want to fight about it? Nah. Good. I'm busy with my morning routine anyway. What's your routine? Eating eggs. Never skip egg day. Eggs finished. It's time to get ripped. That little dude is intense, like a fire at the circus. Oh, that's a, wow, that's a pun and a half, isn't it? That dude is intense, like a fire. Welcome to the water cooler. Chairs have been removed to improve productivity. The jams are too strong to turn off. The jellies are pretty tough, too. God, this game has puns for days. It's a menu, but there's a lot of options. Better just read one of them. Cup noodle pizza, now with more bones! Why do bone- why do pizza have bone in it? Why do pizza have noodle in it? Last and found, I leave last stuff at the end of the bar. Thanks, Whistler. Oh, wait. No, that's not who he is. My pleasure. Now with more bog cheese. I see you met Shortstack. Charming, isn't he? Is that really his name? Sure. You could say that. Hello, something I can help you with? Not unless you know who the boss is and where I can find them. Can't say that I do. Well, neat. A beautiful handbag. The strap breaks when you lift it. A deliciously painful memory is tied to that object. Where are you? In your mind. I have been since the incident. Well, nobody said you could talk. Stop me then. I... I don't know how. Good. Embrace that helpless feeling. Now pick up the object. Alright. Hold it tightly and close your eyes. What was that? Something painful, something hidden, gnawing its way forward. I just gave it a little push. Find more like this. I want you to feel the rest. Hello.
Let's see, this way is hmm, not closed. Interesting. A bunch of papers clutter the desk. There's a book in here, How to Clean Floors for Maroons. Every page says, rip out this page and put it on your desk. Now your floor looks clean. Clean floor, happy floor. You might go through a thousand ideas before you hit one you like. Don't stop trying. It's completely packed with empty pages. Weird. A big ham and a little ham. Ham, ham, ham. It's full of salamander treats? I am doing the sleep. Please to be quiet. Surround yourself with friends, especially the fuzzy ones. See that salamander go running. Hey, there's a pair of sunglasses in here. Hey, bring those over to me at the pool. I need them for work. The screen is covered in sensitive stuff. That's sensitive stuff. Top clearance only. It's full of unfinished stories. That's sad. Sorry, can't talk right now. Super busy. Neat little papers and neat little stacks. Keep your area tidy and work won't be as stressful. It's full of even more papers. I gave all my work to the guy in 3A. What a maroon. It's a totally empty. The edges of a window frame can be seen in each shot. The camera goes off without being touched. A small photo slides out of the side. The printer, what? Oh, shit. The camera printer is jammed. It's raspberry. Who would dare? They leave the windows open from time to time, just enough to reach through and feel the breeze. It's full of unused film and flash tube. Hang in there. You're contractually obligated to keep going. Oof. Rippling energy in an endless sea. Forms seem to coalesce and dissipate at random. Blistering sands bake under the oppressive rays of this world's three stationary suns. You can go to 3A and get a new interaction. Okay. Tell him what the guy in 4B said? Yes. I know. Wait, you do? At the end of the day, he's only robbed himself of progress and experience. When I'm finished with all of this, I'll be better and faster for the future. Honestly, I should be apologizing to him. Thank you for your honesty. Huh. Neat. Do, 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 do. It's a Tower Court brand umbrella table. There's a little tag on it. Keep away from raccoons. Hey, you heard any good rumors? Yeah, I heard about a guy who asks too many questions. Oh yeah, what's his name? I gotta know the details. You tell me. Oh hey, you found them. Yeah, here you go. Sunglasses! Good work, intern! Time for your next job! Not this again. You sound like Oscar. Neat! Here's a dollar! Go get me a coffee! Seriously? Seriously! Get Joe his coffee? Yeah. Alright, fine. I can do that. Good! Catch you later! Hello, Epic Ninja Fork. I'm doing okay. I mean, I'm a little sick. By a little sick, I mean a lot sick, but that's okay. Can't seem to get their attention. Hmm.
How many people are watching? There's no chat. Yeah. Yeah, there were there was a larger audience here. Oh, I'm sorry, Artemis. I'm sorry you're depressed. Um, there was a larger audience, but uh, other other more important streamers started streaming, and everyone was like, "Not nah, peace out." I got the dude's coffee. Hmm. Key looks like solid gold, but it's just a cheap toy. Oh. Oh, more of the memory. Yeah, still in Tower Court. You can leave every Ninja Fork. I'm not going to blame anybody for leaving. You are under no obligation. Here to watch me get ripped? Yeah. <laughs> Thought so, nerd. Anyway, someone left some junk on the bench. I threw it down below if you want it. The bracelet feels cheap, like painted plastic. Have a good day, Epic Ninja Fork. There's a lore petting Baron. Not enough. I need more. Ah, now you're... Hey, nerd, you blinked for a minute there like a weirdo. Yeah, it happens. Impossible. Oh. Oh my god, that's really good. They run so fast. I want to see actually if he has a separate interaction. This music is so good! Go take a nap, Artemis. You deserve a nap. It's your birthday. You can do whatever the heck you want. Bye! Oh, hey, you brought it. Yeah, here you go. <laughs> coffee into the void. That's fine. I don't even like coffee. Keep the change. Get yourself a drink. You deserve it. Oh, don't look at me like that. Ah, fine. I'm sorry. Let me teach you something in return. All right, this better not be a trick, though. Do you know how to whistle? Nope. All right, well, scrunch your face up and blow. <laughs> Look at that animation. Look at his dumb face. He's trying. A uh, little less all of that. There you go. Hey, thanks, Joe. Anytime, intern. Oh, yeah, don't use your newfound skill near the pool. Why not? Just trust me, intern. exactly what I'm going to do. Sharp whistle rings out across the water. Ha! 
bold move. Well, Oscar did say I'm bad at following directions. Your funeral intern. Hey. Uh, hey? Small green need a thing? What kind of thing? Pool pal Paul will show. Yeah, all right. That was a close one. Enjoy shiny, tasty green. Tasty? Small golden heart. There's a picture inside of a younger man with glasses. He looks familiar. Someone's in the stairwell. There's something on the TV. Thanks, Paul. Yep, 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 bye. Another day, another dollar, another coffee. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Mm. Oh. Are you ready to proceed? Uh, not yet. Lacking conviction. Uh, it's probably a good idea to save. Just in case. Did I hit all the rooms? Because I think this is... Yeah, I've been here because that's the coffee room. That's the cafe. You gotta go to the cafe. You gotta get yourself a coffee. What's down this way? Oh, nothing. All right, and I have hit all the rooms. Okay. You ready to proceed? I'm ready. The chain falls apart in your hands. The last piece. Finally. You're always doing this. Doing what exactly? Coddling him. He's never going to grow up this way. Sitting on the couch wasting time with that thing. He's fine. One day he'll be too old to laze his summers away. Let him enjoy himself. He's going to be just like you at this rate. What's that supposed to mean? It means you're weak. You've always been weak. Even now you don't have the strength to stand up for yourself. Pathetic. Mom and Dad are fighting. I don't like it. No, it can't be her. It's time to get out of here. You're right, new hire! Luckily, I've been instructed to open these doors for you! What's on the other side? Paperwork and a bunch of sad stuff! Can you be more specific? Nope! Well, let's get on with it then. Sure thing! Also, give me that hat! It's company property! Whoop! That wasn't even mine. Don't worry, it won't matter soon! See a new hire! Well, this is it. Would you look at this? Abandoning your best friend Joe at the drop of a hat. Speaking of which, where is that hat? Uh, Oscar took it? You know what? He probably deserves it. Any leads on the boss yet? Yeah, at least I think so. Well, lay it on me then. I'm not even sure if it's really her or not. All jokes aside, is everything all right? You seem kind of down. No, I'm pretty stressed out. Mood. Look, I know I can be a bit of a jerk sometimes. Just remember, whatever happens through those doors, I got your back. Thanks, Joe. No problem, intern. We better get going then, huh? Yeah, I gotta get back to the pool. All this talking really tired me out. Wait, what? I thought you said you had my back. Well, yeah, but I'm not getting fired for it. Yeah, I got kids to feed. See ya, intern. Uh, all right. Red carpet. 
Up we go. Hey, new hire! Miss me? Uh, yeah, sure. Good! Are you ready? Ready for what? It's time for your termination! Wait, what? You're no longer valuable to Tower Corp, so now you're being deleted. Lucky you! You can't be serious. You're right! I'm Oscar! Have a good 60 seconds, new hire! Only a few seconds left and you want to spend them with me? I'm honored! Uh. Come on! Oh no! The boss. I want a solid gold coffee cup. Uh-oh. Miss me, moron kiddo. Coming all this way to grovel at my feet to see me. No. Get over here already, brat. Is something wrong, sweetie? Whoops. Clicked out of the window again. It's not real. You can't be real. Leave the boy alone. Nobody speaks to me that way. Dad? He got what he deserved. He's just having a time out, honey. What have you done? I won't let you do this. No more lies! Nope. We're not fighting on your terms. I'm the boss here, not you. Just stop. Or what? Or, or you'll hurt me just like you hurt him. Feeding the poor thing garbage while he pleaded with you. Gaslighting, the boss fight. Yeah. Feed Baron, Viking Feast, or garbage. Oh, I fed him Viking Feast, not garbage. No. He's my best friend. He's always been there for me, even when you weren't. How dare you talk back to me? You've got a habit of doing terrible things. You stole from a poor old man. You didn't even want it, just like you don't want me. Try to steal the apple? No. You're wrong. I know better than to take what isn't mine. I hope you learn the same lesson one day. What did you just say to me? Despite your hurtful words, I still have hope for you. In his final moments, you let him live. You care so much for Baron. Such a compassionate child. Nope. That's not what happened. I... I heard him. I was blinded by fear and didn't recognize him. Even then, I was wrong and I would do it differently given the chance. Arrogant child! How about when you... murdered... Joe? Remember that? We all remember that, don't we? Murder Joe? <laughs> What's wrong with a little murder? <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want to see it. Uh, absolutely not. I love Joe. I feel sorry for you. All you've done is hurt everyone around you. I wish I could help you. No, you can't. I'm in control. Uh-oh. Why do you hate me? I don't hate you. I never did. Even with everything you've done. 
All that pain and sadness just made me stronger. It helped me deal with people like you. People who hate themselves as much as you do. No! Stop! You can't do this! I forgive you, Mom. I didn't kill Joe! Dad? I'm sorry. No, I should have listened to you. I should have paid more attention to what was going on. I just got so wrapped up in work that I forgot what it meant to be a dad. I let you down. It's fine. It's not. But I hope in time it can be. Please take this before you go. What is this? It's a phone. Kind of old-fashioned, I know. No matter how busy I am, I'll make sure to answer if you call. I need to head back to work. Just know you can call me anytime. Wait, Dad? Yes. I love you. I love you too, son. <gasps> Baron! Dog hug! It's hard to face our bad memories. It's even harder to accept them, especially when you wish things happened differently. You're getting stronger. Don't give up. I'm proud of you. I don't think it even let me enter this place before. Fire penguins. Oh no. Another toy in my domain. You will fall with the others, crushed by the molten fist of a true warrior. Thanks for playing Heartbound. More chapters are coming. We hope you like the game so far. All this stuff. Okay, good. And then there's this area. This area is more developed. You know, as I can tell. This is the stuff that I think has made more progress. He looks pretty beat up. Nothing a little pick me up can't fix. Do you really think you can help him? Of course, kiddo. I can do anything. I'm not a kid anymore, Cersei. I grew up... I grew a bunch over the summer and everything. Your links don't count for nothing, kiddo. Now help me get him back to town. Well, that's about the best I can do for now. Is he gonna be okay? Well, it'd take a miracle. Thankfully, I'm a miracle worker. A modest miracle worker, no less. Quiet, you. <laughs> no, look, he's moving. 
Told you, miracle worker. Furries! No, no, please, I can't do this. I can't fight you. Oh, calm down, you big baby. You're safe here in my house. The name's Cersei. And I'm Rammel. We can totally be friends and stuff. You're late for work, kiddo. Mail ain't gonna deliver itself. Oh! Gotta run, see you, green friend. I love them! Anyhow, welcome to Animus, whatever you are. Gotta get back to work. Feel free to get your footing before you head out. Talking animals? I finally lost it. You know what? Whatever. At least they seem friendly. It's a painting of a forest in autumn. Many strange objects wiggle in the muck. Okay, that is nasty. A tough chain and a diamond-shaped lock hold this chest closed tightly. One of them is covered in brown slime. Gross! There's an inscription at the bottom. Hang in there, you big baby. Cersei Thistle. Hello, Serena. Circular iron lock bars your way. Muffled music plays through the door. We're all doing fairly well, I assume. I'm doing fairly well. Animus! Give me a bit, would you, Cersei? Oh, you're a bit tired, Tigrix? I am also a bit tired. Thank. Big seed creepers. The creepiest seeds with the biggest taste. Barnacle crisps. Crunchy crisps to splash with fresh and salt. I think we are all very tired. Ugh, this music is so good. Running on adrenaline. Oh. What have you been up to that you're running on adrenaline? <laughs> Where is it? Where's the monster? Amelia, wait! That's my green friend, not a monster! Your time has come to an end, creature of darkness. Have at you! What the heck are you doing? I've felled the monster. Emilio, your head is harder than your hammer. This thing isn't a monster. I... I see. I've made an error most grave. I'm fine. He didn't even hit me that hard. Anyway, I need to find Baron and get back home. Baron? A friend of yours, I take it? She needs, like, a southern accent, actually. Before you ask, he's my... You know, to be honest with you... I don't really know what he is right now. Either way, part of him is here and I need to find it. Alright, you two, leave this one alone and go home. Got it? Yes, ma'am. Sorry for the trouble. And you, be careful around town. There's a bunch of downright animals out there. Thanks, so keep that in mind. I really gotta get out of here. God, this music is so cre so cute. Hey, I know you're in the middle of playing this game right now. Unfortunately, it's in early access and some parts aren't done yet. Thankfully, the next area is mostly done, which is a lot better than not done. This means you get to explore it. It also means most things won't work and a lot will be changed later. I hope you like it anyway. If you want to leave, go to the giant clock tree and walk into the trunk from the front. Anyway, have fun. You'll be doing dishes and listening to the stream. Fair enough. Ledger sits on a cool smooth stone. Oops. Just want to see what it looks like. 
So much stuff. Is this a leaf I can put in my pocket? N huh? Well, uh, no. So there's the trunk. God, this music is so good. Ooh. I haven't seen this area at all. <gasps> My boy! Oh. Oh. This is very much unfinished zone. I want to speak to him, but I cannot. This music is so good. Oh, Bo Oddball has followed. Thank you. And is now hosting. Exceptional. Thank you. I just want to take a second to appreciate this music. Mm. Well, I haven't seen any of this stuff. Interesting. Ah, good evening, Wangle Line. <laughs> Will I be streaming some more tonight after this game? Uh, maybe. I definitely need to eat something soon. Uh, so I'll probably stream again in a little while. I don't see myself getting any work done today. Um, depends on if my girlfriend's around. I haven't talked to her in a little bit, so I might want to chat with her for, for a minute. <gasps> Please let me talk to them. No. Oh, I love them. That is very much Noel. God, the furry designs in this are exceptionally good. I love them so much. Uh. Uh, Noel is from Deltarune. God, I love them. I can't wait for this bit to be finished just so I can meet all of these animal people. There is absolutely nothing in a game that will get me on board quicker than fucking animal people. I am furry trash and I make no apologies. There was a time when 
one of my viewers would would like I would I would talk about furry stuff. <gasps> a mo boy. Uh, and and they'd like clip it and be like, aha, you admitted to being a furry. And I'm like, what do you want from me? I make no secret of this. I want to know who these people are. Oh, I got a snake. As far as games that I was thinking of, like, streaming, um, I was considering, uh, doing Extreme Meat Punks Forever because the Season 2 Kickstarter is about to go live, but I think I might save that until next week so that I can actually play it while the Season 2 Kickstarter is live and I can post links to that. I'm going to have Heather Flowers on my podcast at some point. Uh... But instead, my th this I'm having fun doing voice acting stuff, so I might do Delta Rune. <gasps> Turtle people. Oh, the music is so strong. Yeah, I love how they wiggle their heads. Animals are good, however they're combined. I just, I find, I think for me, there is a charming emotional simplicity in furries. Ah, jelly fruits as followed, thank you. There's a charming emotional simplicity in the uh, visage of a furry where with human human people, there is a level of like, I don't know, reading them is difficult at times and intimidating. And I think that the simplicity of and like cuteness of an animal combined with like human-ish features is just, I don't know. It just, it feels, yeah, humanizing designs of animals make them, makes them more appealing. I don't know. We humanize literally everything as, as human beings. We project ourselves onto everything around us. We're we're designed we're not designed, but we evolved to recognize faces in everything. Gosh. The New York Times even humanizes Nazis. Oof! That is... That's a hot one. Wow. Good on you. That's a strong take. I think I've seen all there is to see. Yeah, because I've been up here. Uh, I want to know what's up with all these animals. God, I can't wait for this stuff to be done. I love all of these creature designs. I love every one of them. They are my favorites. That's fair, Tigger, because I'm not here to judge. We all have different tastes. Ah, uh, thanks for playing Heartbound. More chapters are coming. What a good game. I am so excited for more. I was hoping that there would actually have been uh, more that was added since last I played. But that's okay. Hmm. 
Boop. All right. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I need to. I need to go. Uh, eat food. So. Uh, I've been streaming for almost three hours. Wow. Okay. Well, that's been heartbound. I am going to go eat some food, and then I might be back later tonight and play another thing. It might be Delta Rune. It might be something else. Thank you, everybody, for hanging out. Uh, yeah. I will see you all later. Take care of yourselves.